Hey guys, it's Deestead. Yeah, I'm here on Prokhorovka, I think he's how you say it, with Spartan and Demarcus Stone. Now, Demarcus, he is a guy I met on the forums, actually. Uh, he is a player who's he's got a 50% win rate, and he's saying to himself, you know, I, I want to... I want to, I'm, I'm tired of feeling like I'm not really contributing to the team. I want to really be a better player. So he was asking for uh, for help, for training or whatever. There's a bunch of Smurfs that uh, offered to help him. And so what he's doing now is, um, is just killing time with us, basically. Because, I mean, we're not that good of players. Uh, I guess, statistically, we're a little better than he is. But, you know, we're just... Uh, we're just killing time together, basically, before uh, he gets to go and platoon with the Smurfs uh, and get some real training. Uh, so that was pretty cool, actually. We had a series of very epic games, Demarticus, Stone, Spartan, and I. Um, and I definitely look forward to playing with him again. Anyways, um, so I'm here in my T-30. And the T-30, it's a tank that's been sitting in my garage collecting dust, uh, doing not a whole lot of very much. And uh, we were playing uh, just basically a series of Tier 9 games. Tier 9 is probably my favorite tier. Tier 9, and then second would be Tier 10, then Tier 8. Anyway, so I had gone through all my Tier 9 tanks, and this was the last one, and so I was thinking to myself, well, I might as well pull it out again. I remember loving this tank. Oh my goodness. I mean, yeah, this thing is so awesome, this tank is. Anyway, so the point of this, the point of this replay, um, you'll notice, you've probably noticed by now, there's uh, two actually replays going on at the same time. Spartan in the top right corner of the screen, I'm in the main screen. Uh, the point of this replay is to emphasize, emphasize how valuable teamwork is and how you can throw a match by abandoning your team. Now, just in a second here, we're going to see a moss. Um, there it is. And what the moss is doing, he's coming around. He's trying to distract us, um, use his armor, bounce some shots, and allow the guys on the hill to come over and kill us. Now, it would have worked. It would have worked had the guys on the hill actually done that. Uh, but what happens, you see here, um, just a second, there we go, E100 bounces off the side of my turret, just an unlucky shot, that should have gone in, just unlucky for him, but he pulls back under the pressure of my teammates. So the Moss essentially got abandoned here, um, had his allies up on the hill just charge down over this, you know, crest of this hill, um, they would have killed us and would have won. Uh, that flank anyways, but instead they got pulled back. And so we're gonna, we just switched here to Spartan's point of view. Um, and so right now they're coming over. I just got shot on the side of the turret by that E100. And I'm sitting here, I, so I call over TeamSpeak. I need some help guys. And so they both whip their turrets around and started shooting at these guys. Now, it doesn't matter if you're penetrating or not. If you're getting shot in the side um, when you're up on that hill, you typically tend to pull back. And so these guys scared him off, saved my life, and this T-57 Heavy. We put the Moss out of commission and essentially just an, uh, just completely stopped what could have been a game-changing move. And so really what happened right there, um, we stuck together as a team, they didn't, we won that fight. And that was their chance, at their, that was their chance at winning the game. Um, and they didn't, they didn't do it. And so now, as you're going to see here, um, Spartan asked me to go and spot the U100. I do, and it's just game over from now on. You got an auto loader punching the side of the U100, artillery coming down. I try to put a shot in, it doesn't go in, but Spartan finishes him off. Demarcus puts in a few more rounds himself um, and does some more damage. Um, but uh, yeah, so it's it's pretty much over. They've they've lost all their armor on this hill, on this side of the of the map. I I go to put a shot into this one two one. It doesn't work out. Um, he's hidden behind the U one hundred. Unfortunately, my T fifty seven heavy buddy he uh, he gets taken out. 
and uh, I take a shot. But I do manage to put a shot into that 1-2-1. One, one. So this match is looking pretty good in our favor. If you look on the mini-map, um, you know, we've taken the other flank. But this Leopard 1, he's gotten behind me, and he's going after our artillery. So I put a shot in. I don't lead it very well, and I, I epically miss. So I call out uh, about the Leopard 1 coming back, and Spartan and, and Demodicus, Demodicus Stone, they're like, yep, we got it. And so they start pumping rounds into him. And, uh, well, <laughs> Spartan <laughs> kind of hit Stone in the back of his tank. So, you know, that was too bad. That because of that, the Leopard 1 gets away um, and uh, comes back over to my side um, of the hill. Now, Spartan, you know, he's, he's almost halfway reloaded already. So he's going to come over the hill over these train tracks and try and get that Leopard 1 before he can do any real damage to me um, because I'm kind of exposed up on this hill. Uh, so we're going to run a little bit uh, just to show you that, uh, well, that, I guess, um, I managed to take out that one two one so this hilltop, as far as we are aware of, is secure. And our main issue is this Leopard that's coming over, uh, back over to my side. Now I'm feeling quite exposed, like I said, uh, he's, he should have a bigger view range than me. Um, you know, he's a medium tank, I'm a tank destroyer, uh, but uh, Spartan manages to spot him. He shoots and misses, I shoot, I don't miss. Um, I learned my, my uh, leading lesson from before. Now it turns out, there's a whole bunch of other tanks up here. Oh, did you see that? Jagdpanzer U100 takes out the 215B183 in one hit. Spartan puts around into this IS-3, I put around into him, and then someone else takes him out. Um, but yeah, there is a whole bunch of other tanks up here. You know, I was thinking, had all these guys worked together, they could have annihilated this whole flank. Could have had a couple, an E-100 and a Moss coming around, putting shots into the back of Spartan and Demartica Stone. Um, we could have, they could have completely secured this flank and turned their attention back, but instead they abandoned each other um, and, uh, well, they lost. Now, Stone, he was trying to get into the cap, he was trying to do his mission uh, to capture the base. Uh, that didn't work out, so, you know, he came under attack and uh, called out for help. I helped him and, uh, yeah, killed the last enemy tanks and we win the game. So that was a great game. Mastery Badge, Ace Tanker, Fire for Effect, Spotter for myself. Managed to pull off 4,600 damage uh, between, you know, Spartan and Marnica Stone. They each got 37, 3,500 damage. Um, I managed to spot 34 of that uh, damage for them. You know, it was just, a, it was just one of those epic games. Uh, the three of us, we came top on the team. Um, you know, it was, um, yeah, it was a good game. Um, because of the teamwork, we managed to uh, pretty much just execute that entire flank between the two of us working together, or the three of us working together, sorry, um, me on the hill, Stone and Spartan assisting uh, from that kind of ridge line in the middle. Um, managed to really just shut down and execute that entire flank uh, between the three of us. So that was pretty nice. Um, that was really nice. Anyways, guys, just wanted to point out, teamwork works. If you work together, um, you can really, really affect the battlefield and, um, and turn the tide of the battle. They would, have, they would have won that flank. I don't know if they would have won the game. Our other flank was steamrolling pretty good. But they would, it would have been a much closer fight. They would have had a good shot at winning the game had they, had they worked together used the the opportunity that the moss gave them and uh you know they would have taken me out and that t57 heavy with ease they would have come around behind to martica stone and spartan and uh they probably would have taken them out in the artillery and then it would have been just a matter of well we our forces would have had to split up uh to come back and deal with the guys in the cap um you know it, it would have been a fair fight again but because they abandoned their teammates and we didn't, uh, it was a steamroll. So yeah, anyways, so make sure you play together as a team nicely. Make sure you, you, you count on each other and you assist each other. When someone's going to give you an opportunity, take advantage of it because you can literally win. 
All right, guys, uh, take care on that battlefield. I'll see you around. Um, yeah, catch you later.